Today I am going to explain you about loop boil auto backlash filter. In this picture you can see this is the changeover wall I used for changing over the uh, filter in use. This, we have the auto filter this side and the manual filter this side. So you can see the arrow mark here. This arrow mark is showing the position here. That means right now auto filter is in use and at the same time the manual filter is in use and this is the outlet. So what I am going to do is I am going to change from this side auto filter to the manual filter this side. So we have to keep this arrow move the arrow to the next position wait for some time until the oil is circulated in both the filters then change over to the manual filter. So this is what we have to do. We have to do it slowly so that uh, oil is there in the manual filter also. So you change over the position. Now you can see this is both the filters on use. Then then change over to the manual filter. Once that is done, then what you do is you can backflash the uh, filter here so that the candle filter will get backflash and oil will get drained. So once you do that, you can put off the power. Then to make sure that the candle filter is fully drained, you can operate the solenoid wall. You can operate the solenoid wall here manually to move the ram so that the oil is drained fully. So while moving this you are doing it manually. You can also do the change over here of the candles. You can see it's moving. So this can be done manually so that you drain the oil fully in the chamber. So while doing this you can see this is the air chamber here. When you are operating the ram you can see the air coming down. So this is this is what happens when you are back flashing it. Then you close the control air which is coming here. Close it. So once you close it then you can open the cover here of the candle filter. You can see there is not a bit of oil you can see. No oil is there. So th you can, then you remove this uh, filter for cleaning. Put it in the ultrasound and clean it nicely. So this is very important part of the uh, uh, routine maintenance. So once you clean this then you can uh, put back. So we have a float inside this cover. So we can see this float. Once the oil fills up then the float will this is the float here you can see inside the cover here. So once it fills up the float will lift. And now I have finished cleaning and boxing back the filter here. You can see in this picture when the oil is getting filled up there is a float here in this chamber. This will lift up and close. And this is the a overflow line which will go to the overflow. So this I have disconnected it. So this you have to connect it once you complete the job. So if you have any doubt regarding changeover of the auto backlash filter you can message me. Thank you.